Hey everybody, uh, this is going to be a three video set on how to create a slightly more advanced search engine for your website. Now I've already done one uh, on creating a very basic search engine which pretty much looks for uh, exact matches of uh, content within within your database. And uh, one of my students, uh, and this is a bit of a shout out to Gus Alum because um, thank you Gus for pushing me to um, look this up. Uh, insisted that it must be possible to do some form of fuzzy logic where we sort of look at what a, what a search criteria sounds like and then see if we can match that sound with uh, the content of our database and sure enough it can be done so uh, in this video I'm just going to give you a little overview of how it works then um, the subsequent videos will go on uh, show you how to insert information into your database um, phonetically sounded out and then the last one will then obviously run through how to do the physical search itself. So just to give you an idea, this is what it looks like. Very basic, there will be no formatting at all. Um, if I search, say, for example, the word quick, uh, you can see something that's in our database. The quick brown fox jumped over the lazy dog. However, um, if I spell quick incorrectly, like so, it actually picks up the sound of what I searched on and matches it with the sound of the word quick in here. Uh, similarly with the word dog, I wonder if I just spelled dog DG, there it is there. Uh, I don't quite know how good this is, um, I wonder if we've got dog, yeah picked it up as well. So um, we're going to be using a function in PHP called Metaphone to, uh, to create this uh, functionality. And so uh, in our database I'm going to be using WAMP server, so um, if you're using different systems just you know, obviously be aware. And uh, in our database here I'm going to have two tables. I'm going to have the table that actually contains the text that we can search on, or sorry, this will be what's displayed. So this would be the content on your website. So maybe your different the content on different pages or however you've organised it. But then I also have another table which I've called Metaphone Text because in it all it is is actually the phonetic sounding out through this Metaphone function of the corresponding text in the text table. So for example, this. Is number one. If I go back to the text, you can see it says the quick brown fox jumped over the lazy dog. Here we've got quick as KK, brown as BRN, fox as FKS, and so on. And you can see how that matches. But not only that, we've got the sounds there. It also matches this to uh, the, the text ID number one. If we go back to the text table, text ID number one is the quick brown fox. So our search is actually going to come to this table here, the metaphone one, and try and match the sound of what has been entered in our search box. When it finds it, say fox like we did, there's FKS, it will then say, oh there's a match there, it will go right, it's text ID 1, go to the text table and return the description that matches or is in the row text ID 1. Right, so that's basically how that's going to work. In terms of the pages that we're going to be creating, uh, obviously we have our search page with the form, uh, we have our search results, but also I'll show a way that you can enter some text. So um, here is a text field. Submit that, and you can see how it has created the metaphone sounding out. And if we go into our database now, if we just rebrowse there, here is a text field has been entered into the text table. The metaphone text table now has the phonetic sounding outs of here is a text field. So that will be um, the sec uh, second video, we'll show you how to insert that stuff. And then our third video will be how to do the search. Okay, so uh, I hope you stick with me, but that's a brief overview. And uh, next video, we'll get into it.